Welcome to the Assam Tribune. You are watching Superfast and I am Anisha and here are the top 10 stories of the day. More than 13 lakh candidates are set to appear for the state level recruitment commission examination which is scheduled to take place on October 27, Sunday across the state. Mobile internet services will be suspended in view of the recruitment exam for class 4 posts. Mobile internet, mobile Wi-Fi and mobile data services of all service providers in the state will be suspended from 8.30 a.m. to 4 p.m. A total of 38 candidates filed their nomination papers for the November 13 by election to five Legislative Assembly constituencies of Assam till Friday. By elections will be held in five, five LACs of the state Dholai, Sidli, Bongaigao, Behali, and Samaguri. Scrutiny of nomination papers will be done on October 28, while the last date for withdrawal of candidature is October 30. To assist the large number of candidates appearing for the Assam Direct Recruitment Examination scheduled on October 27, 2024, the Northeast Frontier Railway has announced the operation of five pairs of examination special trains across Assam. These special trains, each running a single trip in both directions, aim to ease travel and manage the extra rush of examinees on the exam day. The founding editor of Bismoy, a popular entertainment as Ms. Monthly May magazine, Shashi Phukan, passed away on Friday in Guwahati. Phukan was undergoing treatment at Guwahati Medical College and Hospital where he breeded his last agent, 78. Acting on a read petition, the Delhi High Court has stayed the proposed transfer of an elephant from Assam to Sanic Farms in South Delhi. A bench of Chief Justice Manmohan and Justice Tushar Rao Gedela observed that there was no clarity on the need and purpose of moving Ranjita, the elephant, from its present location. The court further directed to implead the Mao Bagalamukhi Temple Trust and listed the matter for hearing on November 28. Despite the plan of the North East Frontier Railway to complete the 51.38 km Bairabi Sairang railway line within nine months, several disputes in Kolasip district have remained unresolved, including compensation issues. A statement issued on Friday revealed that Kolasip Deputy Commissioner recently convened a meeting with district officials, NFR rep representatives and village council leaders from affected areas along the railway route. The meeting sought to address compensation and re related concerns, deciding on a joint verification by the district collector, NFR officials, landowners and VC leaders as soon as possible. The Tripura Forest Department has seized three country-made guns and suspected raw deer meat during a raid in the North Kasari area near the Trishna Wildlife Sanctuary. The seized items were sent to different locations for testing. The guns have been sent to the state forensic lab in Agatala for tests and a meat sample is sent to Dehradun for DNA testing. Security forces in Manipur recovered arms and explosives during search operations in Bishnupur and Imphal West District. The recovered items were handed over to the concerned police stations for further necessary actions. Iran cancelled all flights until further notice due to escalating tensions and security concerns in West Asia. The spokesperson for Iran's civil aviation organization stated today that flights on all routes have been cancelled until further notice. His remarks come hours after the Israeli regime attacked several position, positions in three provinces in Iran. Taiwan's Ministry of National Defense reported Chinese military activity near the island on Saturday and said that by 6 a.m. local time, 22 Chinese aircraft and five naval vessels were detected in the region. The MND further reported that 16 of these aircraft crossed the median line, entering Taiwan's northern and southwestern air defense identification zone. That's all the news we have for today on Superfast 10. Thank you for joining us for news and updates. Stay connected with us on social media. Tune in again at the same time on the lens. Stay safe, stay healthy. Do not forget to like, share and subscribe to the Assam Tribune.